So guys, before this video starts, I just want to mention that I dropped some new merch. And as you can see on the screen right there, we've got some t-shirts, different designs, some hoodies that look really cool, and all of that good stuff. So the link is in the description down below. Check it out right now if you guys haven't already. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys the Morph mod in Minecraft Pokédex. So if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely go ahead, smash the like button right now, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss a video. Well, let's go ahead and start morphing into mobs. Now, the first thing you need to do is basically craft these two items. Now, this is called a player totem, so basically you can go back to uh, your normal form, and this is the item to basically, you know, morph into a sheep or a cow or a pig, etc. So basically we need to craft them and you can't just, you know, get this in the inventory. So if I was to type in player, as you can see, nothing shows up. So we do actually have to craft it. So the player one is this right here. This is the recipe, as you can see on the screen. So we need a stick, we need soul sand and gold ingots. So let's just go ahead, do that and put it in the crafting table. Basically, uh, well, that was wrong. <laughs> so just like that, and the soul sand in the middle, and the stick, just like that. And as you can see, now we get the player totem. So there we go. That's that simple. Very easy. Next one, uh, we need ender pearls. So, well, actually really one. Uh, iron ingots, gold ingots, and diamonds. So that's basically all you need. Let's go ahead and craft that up. Hopefully I remember the recipe. So that's, and the diamond goes up the top. This in the middle, and this on both sides, just like that. And as you can see, this is the thing you need in order to morph into a mob. So there we go. So now that we've actually crafted it, let's go ahead and start morphing. So these are all of the mobs currently that you can morph into. So you can't morph into, say, an ender dragon or something like that. But you can morph into all of these right here, which is still a great lot. So let's go ahead and spawn in. Actually, let me just uh, put that back. Uh, we need the zombie and the villager. There we go. This one's really cool. So we're just going to quickly do uh, time set nights because this will actually burn me during the day. So let's spawn it in and oh, it's holding a weapon. All right. So here we go. Let's get this. As you can see, I'm just my normal self. And if I just click on him, bam, there we go. I am now the zombie, as you can see. Now, if I go in first person, as you can see, I gain another arm. Which is awesome, well, like the hand bit, so that is cool. So I'm basically a real zombie right now, and I don't know where the other zombie went. Where did it go? I have no idea, but anyways, uh, if we were to spawn in, say, a villager, and we hit the villager, usually if a zombie kills a villager, you know what happens, turns into a zombie villager. Now, we actually have that ability to, like, do that, so look at this. Let's just hit the villager. Alright, no, back away, it's my villager, get away from me, <laughs> get away zombie, sorry about that, I had to get rid of the zombie, but <laughs> here we go, let's just hit it a few times, there we go, as you can see it actually turns into a zombie villager, which is really, really cool, these mods on uh, Minecraft Pocket are getting very nice, or bedrock, whatever you want to call it, so here we go, let's just do this one more time, there we go, and uh, let's just quickly change back to, say, daytime, and as you can see, I burn exactly like a real zombie, Obviously, I'm in creative, so I'm not going to take damage, but if I'm in survival, as you can see, I'm starting to take damage, and I will probably die like that. So, there we go. That is the zombie one, which is very, very cool. Now, if I just do this, or hold the, uh, the player totem in my hand, I go back to my normal form, which is really cool. So, I mean, we can turn into a villager if we really want to, as you can see. There we go. Doesn't go exactly the same, as you can see. But uh, now, as a villager, these zombies are probably, um, they, they want to get rid of me, uh, obviously, if I'm in survival. So, what happens if they actually kill me? Actually, I don't want that. Nope, run away. <laughs> uh, let's go in first person. What does it look like? Oh, okay. Well, you can't even see your arms because they are, as you can see, like, crossed over. So, very cool. Very, very cool. Uh, let's move over to the next one. That zombie just died. Uh, Alright, let's just uh, put these back. There we go. All right, let's just spawn in the first row. There we go. So let's do the new mob. Well, actually, fairly new. Uh, so here we go. Bam. Wait, did I not do that properly? Okay, I clicked on it. Oh, maybe I have to go back. All right. And bam. There we go. <laughs> now that works. Uh, so let's just quickly put this here. I want to see the arms. Oh, so this one you can't actually see it, even though it's like kind of like the, the zombie arms. 
I thought I would have seen like pink right now, but you can't see it. <laughs> uh, so yeah, you actually have to change back each time. All right, well that makes a lot of sense. Enderman, uh, no, let's do the husk. So here we go, and bam. Now I am a husk. It makes like a um, weird sound. Oh, I did not mean to change back. Oh my goodness. All right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's just put this here. There we go. Uh, go back to the husk. Now do I see... Oh, I see the arms. Yes, perfect. I don't know why I couldn't see the other one, but uh, anyways, I mean, it still works. Very, very cool. Uh, let's go back to the player. It's so simple that it just, you know, changed back. This is probably my favorite morph mod in uh, Bedrock. Just because the other ones were, like, a little bit more difficult, I guess. Alright, let's turn into an Enderman. Uh, if I can reach it. Where did you go? Where did he... S what? Where did he teleport to? I don't know where he went. Uh, oh, there he is. Oh, you're hiding from me. Get back here. There we go. Enderman. There we go. <laughs> I wonder if I can hold... Ooh, what would it look like if I hold, like, a grass block? I don't think it's gonna look exactly correct. Yeah. <laughs> it's a little bit weird. As you can see, it's behind me. So, yeah, a little strange. But, yeah, now I'm a, uh, an Enderman. Oh, I did not mean to do that. I can't swim! Alright, there we go. We are out, and boom! Back to my normal form. Alright, we already did the zombie. Let's do the stray. And do I get the bow as well? Ooh, okay, I don't. Can I see my hands? <gasps> Look at my arms! <laughs> They're so tiny. Okay, I did not mean to pick that up. Get out of here. Look at my arms. They're like sticks. That is crazy. Uh, I wish we could turn into a parrot, but, you know, that's not possible as of now. All right, next one. Wither skeleton. Ooh, okay. Let's see. Ooh, nice. Can I hold a sword properly? Is that, is that possible or no? Okay, it's not possible. Get out of there. <laughs> Alright, see the arms? Oh, you can't see the arms. Well, I mean, they're not really holding out like a zombie. Uh, Alright, that, that's, that's pretty cool. Alright, next one, creeper. Alright, there we go. We're now a creeper. Look at that. That is perfect. We are twins. We are brothers. Actually, I think he's a little bit taller than me. Hang on. Uh, yeah, only just. Only just. Now, this one we can't actually, like, explode as a creeper. But you can, like, scare your friends. Pretend you are the creeper. I don't know. Just things like that. <laughs> Alright, next one. Uh, well, that was actually all of them right there. So, you know what? Let's just get rid of them. Just like that. Alright, next wave. Alright, we already did the villagers. So, we don't need to do that again. Uh, zombie villager. I guess we can turn into that. Alright, let's do the blaze. Alright, here we go, my normal self. Yes, I am. Boom! Now, a blaze. Now, this is a little tricky because... Oh, actually, I can just do that. Alright, so as a blaze, I'm pretty sure if I hold shift, yeah, I start flying. <laughs> so this is, a, a, like, an ability you can do, and if I, you know, let go of it, I drop back down. So that is actually really cool. I'm pretty much a blaze. Again, you control your friends or do whatever. Uh, and I'm just holding shift right now, and it's just bringing me all the way up and let go, and I just start flying down, so, well, actually dropping down. Now, I don't know how this will work in survival. Alright, let's see. Will I take damage? Wait, hang on. I need to do, like, a bigger drop. Alright, let's see. Oh! So I don't take damage. Alright, let's see from this height. Alright, that's actually cool. That's really cool. Alright, next one. Uh, skeleton. Oh, okay. Hey, 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 hey. Relax. Yo, yo, yo. Why are you killing me? I'm basically you. <laughs> Alright, can we see the arms? Yes, we can. Perfect. Alright, let's turn into a cow. Here we go. Obviously, you can't see the arms because cows don't really have arms, I guess. They have legs. So, boom. There we go. We are a, a cow. We can eat some food. Wait, what, is, what if I shift? Oh, it doesn't really do anything. But we can jump as a cow. We can... Okay, we don't want to hold a weapon as a cow because that's a little weird. We can fly as a cow, which isn't exactly right. But I guess you can scare your friends once again. Alright, back to my form. Let's do a pig. There we go. Simple as that. Oink, oink. <laughs> uh, let's do a chicken. Oh, look at that. I am you, my friend. I still think they're a little bit bigger than me. I don't know, it's kind of hard to tell, but let's see. Does my wings flap down if I fall? No, it doesn't. What if I shift? Uh, okay, so we can't, like, flap the wings, but still pretty cool. I can, like, act as a chicken, like, this whole time. And, hello, little ocelot. 
Oh, I wish we could turn into you. Hang on, let's try it. Yeah, it doesn't actually work. <laughs> Unfortunately. Uh, sheep. I mean, you guys know to drill. Boom. We are now a sheep. Uh, let's see. What else do we have? Zombie villager. Alright, there we go. We got the arms. And we are now a zombie villager. Very, very cool. Turn back. Let's spawn in the next wave of uh, spawn eggs. So, what, what else do we have? Okay, we've got a witch. Uh, okay, yeah. Oh, those are the last ones. And then the villager we already tried. So, I want to try the pillager. This thing would look pretty cool. I, I, I think it should. Uh, wait, am I myself? Yes, I am. Boom. Alright. Ooh, okay. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, let's go back to myself again. Uh, let's try the witch. Ooh, okay. We're not going to be able to see the arms for this one because it kind of crosses over just like a villager. But, wait. Hang on. My nose is... Is it a little bit weird? <laughs> wait, is it right? Yeah, wait. For some reason, my nose looks a little out of place. Is it just me or... Yeah, no. Nah, we look slightly different. Just a little bit. I think the nose is supposed to touch, like, my chin area, but... It's kind of not, so that's, that's actually kind of funny. <laughs> Alright, let's try the next one. Uh, okay, well, same kind of deal here with the uh, the villager look. This one, yeah, the nose actually is the same. Alright, that's perfect. Uh, what else do we have? We got these guys. Oh, okay, once again, just the villager kind of look. But, yeah, that's cool. Uh, I think that's all of them, is it? So there's one more thing that I forgot, and as you can see, I'm now a zombie, and uh, I forgot that you can do this. You can actually ride them uh, if it is an adult one, so there we go, and look at that. <laughs> Very cool. Now, I don't know if we can actually morph into a little baby one, so what happened to that baby one? Where did it go? Did it go down here? No. Oh, there it is. All right, did we change? No, we can't be a baby one. That's unfortunate, but we can turn into a like an adult one, and uh, then we can ride it. So that is one thing I completely forgot you can do as a zombie, but <laughs> I guess you can just see where the zombie takes you. Come on, move! No, you don't. You don't want to move. Wait, hang on. What if I do effect? Right, I, I want to see if this goes crazy. Uh, let's do speed. Let's just do that. Does that not change all of us? Oh, it does. Okay. <laughs> Why are you in the water? Okay, you know what? Let's try Let's try a different one. Uh, let's go back here. Alright, I need to quickly... Alright, there we go. Now go! Go, my zombie! Come on, you have speed! You got, like, your Sonic now. But anyways, guys, that is going to wrap up today's video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, definitely go ahead, smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel, all of that good stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace! See ya!